Right here at the corner of 33rd and Allegheny Avenue is where a couple hundred people gathered last night. Those who took part told me they're just trying to have a little fun, but some neighbors in the area, they got concerned over the size of this crowd, called police to come and break it up. With little to do and virtually nowhere to go on a hot summer's night, some of the neighbors here along West Allegheny Avenue decided to have their own fun right outside their front doorstep. Just all good vibes, music, cookout, food. Um, that's all it really was. Chris James says there had to be 150 to 200 people gathered here last night. From this cell phone video, you can see there was little to no social distancing. And while some wore masks, many did not. I don't really have any concerns personally. But Josh Doe does have concerns. But the top concern on his list isn't COVID related. I'm worried about violence more so, I'm worried about coronavirus. On a day to day basis. Neighbors like Hixie Cothran, who live here on West Allegheny, couldn't help but notice the party like atmosphere. There was a lot of noise, and I gathered it was a party going on because I looked out of my window and I seen a lot of teenagers going that way. She's worried last night's gathering could yield bad results. The younger people, they don't take it seriously, you know, because they're young, they're healthy. Here we are, we're older and we have to be very careful. So, but the young people, they just take it as a joke. It was a similar scene on Colgate and Alcott streets in Northeast Philly. People unmasked, standing elbow to elbow. We weren't expecting the number of people that was out here. It's maybe about 500 people. Matthew Hawkins admits attending this event was a risk, and police did eventually show up and disperse this crowd. We weren't, uh, you know, negating the fact that COVID is around. Um, that actually was a big issue for the uh, police officer. So when he brought that to our attention, that's when we like subdued everything. And we told everybody, all right, it's going to have to be time to go. And we're told that crowd did willingly disperse and nobody was arrested and there was zero violence at either gathering last night. In West Allegheny, Stephen Fisher, NBC 10 News.